found one. She's not a super giant, but she's big enough to work. I would say she's anywhere between, well, I don't know, maybe five to eight pounds. It's really hard to tell. This water's four foot deep. And uh, it's murky because there's a lot of activity here, a lot of, a lot of bass right here. So um, I'm going to pitch a jig. And I put a just a regular little strike king craw, I'm not even sure, Berkeley craw, um, packet craw, whatever, on the back of this. Um, this jig I made years ago, it's got a big owner hook on it, it's a deep throat hook. Um, so when, when I get her stuck, she should stay, she should stay on. So uh, <clears throat> let, me give her, let me give it a shot real quick, see what happens. Because the sun, so I can't tell if she's up there. A lot of people think that jigs are just for, uh, you know ledges or rocks or <clears throat> this is grass it's all grass in here and I like to throw a jig I like to throw a jig because we get a reaction from the bigger ones they they can't stand it. the smaller ones will, they'll kind of stay away from it so if there is a male around a female should pick it up first again I can't even see because the sun's not out camera off for a minute until the sun comes out and um, I can see what the hell she's doing. I want to make sure we got plenty of film. It's a nice fish. Anyway, I might have been her looking at it. Give her another shot here. Wait till the sun comes out. Turn it back on. 